Hello traders, welcome to Alice Blue. This is Stephen Gogo, and in this video, I'll discuss about zinc. So, this is zinc. Uh, so, I given a range, uh, uh, resistance line. I think you will remember yesterday I told uh, 207, this was a resistance line. But the, if you see right now, uh, market behavior, they're creating lower low, right? Uh, sorry, lower high, right? They're creating lower high, but uh, they're uh, uh, creating here lower low. Now you can see they are trying to create a lower low uh, because here was a resistance line that is why I uh, not rec uh, recommend you to take a buy below this uh, resistance line because we are expecting that uh, it is totally oversold zone and uh, if you see in a small time frame it is not clear so that is why let's see in a uh, daily chart so daily chart here you can see this is uh, this was a resistance line right this was a resistance line here was a resistance line so now let's see if the price is not uh, able to create new high then uh, definitely price will put down to our right so where is the next our supporting zone by connecting previous higher point here i just draw a um, horizontal line so we have seen here around uh, you can see here uh, 202 we have seen a supporting line and Next, if you see here by connecting previous higher point and lower point, and here it is 199, which is another supporting point. So, if you want to trade, so we must trade in between this range only. So, this is our trading range. Uh, our range will be uh, 207 to 199, at least uh, 8 rupees, in between 8 rupees, right? So now let's see in small time frame like 15 minutes. Have you seen? Right now the price is just near uh, 200 moving average. So if you see previous market behavior, the price was not bouncing from 200 moving average. The price was bouncing from 150. Have you seen this one? Price just uh, pushed down toward this 150 again bounce. So here you can see they broke this 150, and so we are expecting the price will comes uh, near 202 to our first supporting line so i'm looking for here to break this 200 moving average and they retrace toward uh, this 200 moving average if we get any opportunity we will start selling from this area and our target will be 202 and again if they break this level so our next target will be 199 right so here you can see that right now the price is running like that our supporting point if you wanna uh, see the small like 15 minute supporting zone so let me draw here by connecting previous higher point so have you seen I just connected now we can see this is uh, our supporting line uh, sorry resistance line this is a resistance line this is a resistance price just testing here 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 have you seen uh, five time they are testing uh, testing uh, that line to break this area but they are not able to break this level right now you can see this is the upper band so let me take this lower band toward this area right have you seen now you can see we have seen the trend channel or you can say like the price channel we found here price channel they are running like that right like that so that is why I'm expecting price will just hit this channel. That means they will break this 200. Again, price pull up toward 200 moving average, right? So if they pull up toward 200, I'll start selling from this area. And my target will be around 202. And I'll close my position here. And if price comes and break here, again, this trend channel, I'll start, I'll add another uh, sell position. And my target will be here around. So when price will comes here so i'll close my position right and then looking for to break this level again they, if they break this level so i'll start selling from this level right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching